Hello, in this video, we will cover HTML tables. HTML tables allow web authors to arrange data like text, images into rows and columns of cells. Table is created with table tag. All the contents and other related tag of table goes within this tag. To create a row, you use tr tag. Within it, you nest one or more td tag to create column. These are nested as many number of times to achieve the desired number of rows and columns. The content is left aligned by default. If you have a header row, you use th tag to define the header row. It is by default bold and centered. Let's see this once again with an example. Suppose you have this table which you are asked to display in HTML. You will first use table tag as the entire content goes inside the table tag. Then you will use tr tag to define the rows. Since we have a header, we will use th tag for each column for the first row. For all the other column cells, we will use td tag. As you see now, our HTML table is ready. We will learn about HTML attributes shortly to format the table. These three tags have multiple layout attributes, all of which are not part of HTML5 and recommended to be handled in CSS. Let's look at attributes of table tag first. The border attribute tells the browser width of browser in pixels. Border is equal to zero removes the border itself. Border color is used to specify the table border color. Next is frame attribute, which is used along with border attribute. It can have any of these values and determines which of the border will display. Void is used to display no border. You can also use the rules attribute within the border. It determines the inside borders and can have any of these values. Table has two additional attributes of cell padding and cell spacing given in pixels. Cell padding gives space between cell wall and cell content. Cell spacing gives space between the cells. Next few attributes can be used in TR or TD to get row or cell specific formatting. Align is used to change the alignment of text. It can be left, right, center or justify. B align is used to vertically align the text and it could be top, middle, bottom or baseline. BG color, background are used to either have single background color or set an image. Height and width are used to set the height and width of the cell. Row span is used to merge the rows. It takes an integer value which gives number of rows to be merged. Column span attribute is used to merge the columns. They specify the span of columns to be merged. You can also use caption tag to give title or explanation for the table and it shows up at the top of the table. There are also three tags T head, T body and T foot which can optionally be used to create separate sections of the table. T head tag is used to create a separate table header. T body tag is to indicate the main body of the table. T foot is used to indicate a separate table footer.